What's good guys, welcome back to a very special episode of GNG News. In this video we are going to continue from where we left off yesterday. So if you guys remember we had just completed the trainer school and we had unlocked more of this island. So we had to go with Lily who was going to show us around this island, all the shops and all that cool stuff. So without further ado, let's go and do that. If you guys are enjoying this video don't forget to leave a like on the video and subscribe to my youtube channel turn on post notifications because that way you will be informed of when i upload new content i have been debating getting a cosmic eclipse trainer um, elite trainer booster box and a couple of other booster packs as i've seen a good deal going on ebay at this moment in time so that might be something that i maybe do i might buy that later today or maybe tomorrow i'm still having a look around to see what the best deal is um and then i'm gonna get a load of boosters for you guys and I'm gonna try and open them up over November and maybe the Christmassy December period. So anyways, let's get on with this. How? Beach time, yeah. Hey you, you've come to Alola from someplace far off, haven't you? I can tell. It's my swag. Then let me teach you the proper way to greet someone in Alola. Alola. Give it a try, just like that, Alola. You'll make more friends if you say it. So I know that we've also, where is it? It's just, what is it, by this corner or the next corner? There's a little, something should pop up very soon which will let us use the camera ability. Um, and the reason why I like Ultra Moon and Ultra Sun more than Sun and Moon is all of Romton's abilities and obviously like the Ultra Beast that you can battle I think it's pretty cool the Wingo Fly and their droppings fall are the beauty of nature okay look catch would you stop I know they're squishy but there's no reason to throw Pukamuka at me Throw a Pokeball if you must throw something. Ground type won't reach flying type Pokemon, right? So they don't do any damage, but water type moves will wash away any ground type. They're very effective at that. As I always say, make sure you speak to all the NPCs in the game because you'll have Pokemon battles and You'll get given items and you'll learn little things about the lore and they essentially just try and help you out with playing the game. <clears throat> ah, so this little crack here is where you first start to use your Romtom camera. So before we do that, let's speak to everybody. Just to make sure that we don't miss anything. There's one by there as well that we can speak to. Let's speak to her for a second. You're here on vacation, young friend, or, or perhaps are you a trial goer? I'm a trial goer. Well, you are most welcome to Alola either way. In fact, why don't you take this? So, as you see, like I said, more people you speak to in Pokemon games, the better it works out for you. So we just got a free item. We spoke to everyone here. Now let me just show you something. So just by here, in a minute, you'll be able to use your Romton camera. I felt like there was something hiding behind the wall and laid right into it with a karate chop. After all, karate chop makes it easier to deal a real devastating critical hit. So yeah, this is where you'll start to use your camera very soon. So here's how, hey GMG News, I thought I recognised the sound of those feet. That's a bit stalkerish. He's learnt the sound of my feet pattern. So what do you think? Hello, Hal Oil is something, A eh? Alola's got to be the best place ever to live. Oh, yeah. Hey, GMG News, come in here with me. I've got a good idea of something you could do. Hey, miss, is it true that you can get some kind of special gift if you have a Romtom Dex? My goodness. You get the news fast. Hardly anyone has a Romton Dex, but it is true that we have a special item to go with it. It's our very own Poker Finder. Here you go. Awesome. 
Isn't that awesome, GNG News? You've got a Poker Finder. So, like, what's a Poker Finder? The Poker Finder is a tool that lets you take photos of Pokemon. Romtom will help point out places where you'll be able to take photos too. Here, I'll read you the instruction manual. Tap on Romtom by pressing R, which is the back right trigger. Um, that's all it says, quite simply, isn't it? Man, the Romtom Dex is cool. It's like a whole another partner, GNG News. I mean, on top of your Pokemon partner. Oh, but I guess since it's Romtom inside, it's pretty much a Pokemon partner. Either way, you're pretty darn lucky. Meet you outside when you're done in here. The photos you can snap a Pokemon with a Poker Finder, they are simply too cute to resist. Let's make sure we speak to everyone in here. So what does this guy want us to do? Doing research on various Pokemon. I need to record the difference between 10 species of Pokemon for my survey, but I've been working so hard. My back is killing me. You look like a sensible young trainer and the sort of person that I need to help me out. I'd like you to ask 10 different species of Pokemon and basically come back and show me. Oh, look at that already. You've already caught 10 species of Pokemon, then show me. Oh yes, this is perfect. This is all the data I needed. Thank you. Why don't you take this? A little thank you for helping me out. 10 Ultra Balls. So, always make sure you catch as many Pokemon as you possibly can and you speak to all the NPCs in your Pokemon game. As I always say, you know, you can get free items, you can get battles, you can learn things about the lore and just pick up information about the game that you're playing. Oh yeah, this is the lo uh, the lotto drawer as well that you can do in the game. You can do this once per day and you can win yourself some cool items. Another little free thing that you can do in the Alola region uh, to help you win some stuff. We didn't win this time. You can draw once a day. So yeah, it's just one of the things you just got to come back once per day to do it. And... Um, Get yourself some free stuff. And who doesn't love free stuff? So here's Hal again. And here's Lily Jin. Did you visit the tourist bureau? How was it? We got his Rom Todd decks upgraded. Now we can take pictures. What a wonderful helper you are, Rom Tom. Huh? What was that for, Rom? So I'm going to put that little trickster back in your bag, GMG News, and follow me. Enough feasting for the eyes, it's time we take care of our stomachs. Maybe Rom Tom wanted to get your attention because it wants to take photos with you. I think I'll go stop by the appeal shop to do some shopping of my own. Yo, trainer, look what you've got. You lucky kid, if you got a poker finder then I guess I'll give you a little tip. See this little crack in the wall by here as I was saying to you guys? See that spot where the wall is cracked? That's a photo spot right there. Look at that, your rom -tom there is trying to tell you to give him a tap. And it says on the bottom screen, if you guys can see that. You can't see it now but it's just this bit, it said tap me when the icon changes. So. As you can see on the bottom screen, it says right click. I've now right clicked the back right trigger. So it's firing up the Pokedex. Pokedex finder, should I say. So this is the Pokemon that we are going to uh, take a picture of today, which is a Pikachu, none the other. So what you need to do is you can take up to six shots. Uh, you use the analog stick to find your Pokemon. When you first start off, you, you're in version one, so you don't have a flash, you don't have a zoom, and you don't have anything to attract Pokemon yet. So all you can essentially do is just line up the shot, get the Pokemon in the middle of the shot, and just 
take some photos and basically people can rate your well rom tom can rate your photo so you have your six photos down the bottom here you choose which one you think is the best to me they all look pretty much the same so i'm just going to choose the last one press yes and it will upload your photo so as you can see on the bottom here you get all these different comments of whether it was a good picture or not and we got 802 thumbs which is our current record as you can see it says that's one sweet record you hit a new record for yourself and if we get 1500 we can upgrade the camera to version 2 so we're gonna continue shooting and try and do that just because I want to show you what you get as an upgrade for version 2 Okay, one more and we'll be at version 2 as we now have 1,212 total thumbs up. So let's continue <clears throat> and I'll just show you what's the Poker Finder upgrade to version 2, what you get with it. Okay, now... That was probably the best photo. So, is this your best shot? Yes, it is. Twenty-five is now our record, and we have two thousand and twenty and two thousand thirty-seven thumbs up. So we've upgraded to version two. Transmitting the data, data complete. Version two, you can now finally zoom in on things, you lucky little things. So let's close the poker finder because we don't need that anymore. I hear it's the best to try and photograph Pokemon head on and zoom in on close as possible. If you want to know more about the Poker Finder, we'll just keep on taking tons of pictures. So we uh, we did some more. Let's keep on going. So I think Lily's now going to show us the apparel or appeal shop, whatever you want to call it. So as you can see here. Oh, GM News, tell me, do you pick out your own clothes? Of course I do. Of course, most people don't. Most people do, don't they? I've always just worn clothes that my mother wanted me to wear. I don't really know what kind of thing would suit me, but that's not what I. That's not why I stopped you. I mean to give you this, GM News. I received inside at the appeal shop. I didn't even buy anything. They just said I was there. 99,999 customer to visit the store, but I already have the same one, so I thought that maybe you might want it. We have a lens case. Lovely little lens case. It looks like we have something in common now, don't we, GMG News? This is a sparkly sticker, something good may happen if you remember this later on. So as you guys all know, you have to collect stickers in this game. Um, the totem stickers, once you have all of them, you can get yourself something really cool. So I believe if I speak to this woman, we'll now be the 10,000th customer. We don't have enough to buy anything. Okay, so I don't think there's anything we can actually trigger in here. But we know where we can get our clothes from now, so I guess that's a help. 
If you guys are enjoying this video, don't forget to leave a like on the video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and turn on post notifications. We just received a silk scarf as well off this old lady. Thank you very much. A Pokemon with silk scarf will find its normal type moves have more oomph than normal. Look, a salon and a pill shop. I'm going to turn myself into a whole new person. So obviously if you go inside of here, you can get haircuts done. I'm not going to do that because I don't need to get a haircut done. Uh, what else do we have? We can't go in there yet. I've been itching to go shopping, but the shopping mall is closed for renovations. It's not open up yet until you unlock more in the game. Captain Lima. Let's see what he wants. Greetings, Captain Lima here. So you spotted me sticking up one of these lovely stickers, haven't you? That's a sticker? Oh yes. If young trial goers collect these stickers as they travel and follow the path, they indicate they will quite naturally progress along their island challenge. Really, if I had to describe them, I would say their stickers really save trial goers like you. <clears throat> yes, because you can get a very cool Pokemon by collecting them. Well, different Pokemon. But I cannot let my guard down. Those Team Skull folks have far too much time on their hands and they're always trying to get in the way of trainers on the island challenge. I have to keep an eye out to be sure they don't take down my stickers. I've actually just had to report that Team Skull was seen making trouble around town. I suppose I should go and have a look. Well then, young GMG News, I hope you have a delightful time running about to search out and collect totem stickers. So now we can collect totem stickers. So that's our first totem sticker. Let's go back to where we was to get the second one. That's another part of the game as well, which makes the game a little bit longer. So if you collect totem stickers, you can get totem Pokemon, which are essentially Pokemon that are bigger than their normal size. Um, and you wouldn't normally find these in the game. By collecting so many stickers, you will get different totem Pokemon. And it's a way that makes you continue playing the game for a little bit longer. We've just been given a heal ball as well by um, a random member of the public which is a great Pokeball to have because a Heal Ball, if you essentially lower the HP of a Pokemon like you normally do when you're going to catch a Pokemon, if you throw a Heal Ball and successfully catch a Pokemon in a Heal Ball, it will heal it back up to full health. So this is something, this is a ball that you want to have and getting one given to you for free is always great. So we've now healed our team up, as you guys have noticed if you watched my previous video, I recently just evolved my popular water starter into a Brion, so we're already on the second evolution, so we're not doing too bad. And yeah, we're just trying to make our way through the game as much as we possibly can, and just, you know, try and progress a bit more so than what we already have done. Seen that Pokeball there, let's get that. There's a totem sticker in here as well. Perhaps you could snag it with a fishing rod. So when you've got a fishing rod, come back. You can take that out. There's one just by here as well. So that's three already. If you guys enjoy me playing Pokemon Ultra Moon, leave a like on this video. And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and turn on post notifications because that way you will always be informed of when I upload new content. And let me know if there's any games that you might want me to play in the future, Pokemon games, and I will try and get hold of them. I have majority of the mainline Pokemon games, but I want to try and finish off all of them and um, get every single game that I can. So we've got a Lusomize Galat. It's a kind of pastry from the region where uh, Lima went to study abroad. It's his favorite. You see Lima gain the captainship because he ex excludes pure skill. Seeing him is like looking at myself back on the stage and in the spotlight again. So this is his mother. But anyways, thank you once again for watching another episode of GNG News. Don't forget to subscribe. Turn on them post notifications if you haven't done already. Like this video if you think it deserves a like. Share it with your friends if you want other people to see this. Leave a comment in the comment section down below. And I'll catch up with you lovely people in the next episode very, very soon. Keep on smiling. Never give up on yourselves. And remember, guys, when things get hard, that's normally when they're about to give, get good. Leave a like on this video, and I'll see you all soon.